Hello everyone and welcome. I would like to call this a spring vlog, but it's been so cold and rainy. So I decided to dedicate myself to a hobby of mine. My lip balm ended, so I needed to do some more. We just need three ingredients, karité butter, coconut oil and some bee wax. It's a wonderful feeling to know that you can do products by yourself and be sure that they are made with the best ingredients. I always choose ingredients that are biological and natural, no chemicals. I started doing vegan candles with soy wax and then evolved to do lip balm, body cream, deodorant and re-diffusers. What I thought it would be a great challenge, in fact, it was not. You can read the instructions two or three times and then you just memorize it. It will be incorporated in your mind. Doing these things for myself is a pleasure because it relaxes me and it's also a form of self-care. A friend of mine does her own laundry detergent and I suspect that will be my next learning. With a new baby on the way, I know that in the first year or so, I will have to use a different detergent for her clothes, as her skin is very sensitive being a newborn. Besides, doing your own products is not difficult. It just requires time and patience, which I understand that for some people, the first one is very hard to obtain. So I feel very lucky and thankful that I get to do this. Most of the containers that I have here are being reused. This way it's better for the environment and saves me money. It is almost impossible to combine ingredients just for one lip balm, so I usually make two or three and then give them to family members. Before you close them, let them dry for a period of time. The weather went from foggy to rainy on the afternoon. There is nowhere to go, so I decided to bake something for Easter. I ordered this carrot cake from Amazon and decided to try it out. I thought it had all of the ingredients inside beside the eggs, but I was wrong. It only has the flour and the base for the cream cheese. Oh, and a tiny cardboard cake pan. So I mixed the larger package with two eggs and some shredded carrot. The recipe called for one spoon of water, which I found strange, but I still follow the instructions. Add the butter and mix for a minute and a half. And the cake itself is done.
The oven is on 120 degrees Celsius. And the cake will stay here for 50 minutes. Before you add the cream cheese top, the cake has to fully cool down. I thought I just needed a second package to do the top, but I noticed that the cream cheese was needed, so I went to the store. Combine the cream cheese with the second package and mix. And then cover the cake. I also added these cute bread dough carrots to embellish. In the end, it's a really small cake. But it's very convenient since me and my husband are leaving in two days to an extended weekend. Lara will be with my sister and me and my husband get to have a little time to ourselves, date and relax. Dating your spouse is really important to maintain that beautiful connection that preserves the balance and partnership that every relationship needs. We will end the vlog here. Thank you so much for being with me and happy Easter everyone!